All right, hello, and welcome back to Psychonauts 2. I'm gonna unmute the game. It's kind of loud, but it is what it is. Let's see if I remember where we were. I think last I remember we were out in the wilderness. Just got the brain. Or the quarry, not the wilderness. Right. Going back here. You see the color. So, uh. Yeah, 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 yeah. Hey, Nick. I've got something here that will help. Is it a blindfold? Earplugs? Better. Well, time to fix that brain of his. I don't know if you want to come in. Oh boy. Whoa, 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 what the? Ball of light? Are you in here? I'm here. Everything's here. Too many things are here. You're experiencing a sensory overload. Try to stay calm. Whatever you do, don't have a... Oh. Gonna be cute. Fire. I don't want to beat it. It's just too fast. Dear universe, please shut up. <laughs> there we are. This is good. Let's stay here. Oh. And manipulation. I don't like the looks of these, but I guess they're a sign that he's remembering something. That looks like a person. Hope this is a good memory. Hmm. Where are we? Hope this is a good memory. I don't like the looks of these, but I guess they're a sign that he's remembering something. Uh, come in. Oh. Hey, I know you. Your vision. Yeah, and you're needed on stage. Come on, Psy King. My dark place. Psyche. It looks like I was in a mouth. Oh, that, that makes sense. This is quite the world to explore. Oh, they look mad. Would they be happy if we could just play for them? That's Ford's voice, it feels. The senses. 
the situation. Nick's body is sending you all sorts of sensory input. Smells, tastes, visual Thank you sounds, for the blink. tactile feedback. You've just got to deal with it. How you doing, Annie? We know how to deal with a crowd, man. Speak for yourself. I don't remember a thing. You know, vision sounds a lot like my friend Ford. Oh, yeah. Were you in a band with Ford Cruller? Ha. <laughs> Good old vision. He always had such a good eye for, you know, visuals. I see. Well, maybe when you're full ah, memory. Right. The throwing things again. Just sees me as a pair of eyes. Uh, Almost and, had it. Oh, I, I, I just need to focus a little longer with yeah. their voyance. Oh, still just stardust. Do anything? Sounds bad. But I do see more collectibles. the other side. We'll see what's over here. you guys yeah it's always rough on the opening act sorry I guess there's another thing I haven't tried. Oh, yeah. Cool.
don't know how I missed that one. Hey, it's fine now. Right, I can set fire to paintings. Not posters, got it. Coming back to me, don't worry. Maybe just a bit lost. You know what this crowd wants? Yeah, they came for a feast of the senses. I've done everything but talk to them, right? So give it to them. Oh wow, man! It's been so long. I I, I don't even know where my violin is. What is a Feast of the Senses? What is a Feast of the Senses? Is it a band? Well, it's more than a band, man. It's a non-stop festival of sights, sounds, smells, feelings, and flavors. And yes, it was our old band. Our old friends. Who was in the band? Besides me, there was, uh, Tasty, Dr. Touch, Audio, Sniffles, and, of course, on the mic, we had the Psy King. What happened to the feast? Well, the audience just disappeared one day, and the band drifted apart. Uh, I'd do anything to get the band back together again. I'll find your violin. Just tell me where you last used it. Can I even remember what it looked like? Yeah, if only you could see the world the way I see it. Oh. Oh, that's trippy. Huh. I thought the inside of an eyeball would be... goopier? Huh. This kind of reminds me of our old stage setup. Coincidence. Well, it ain't that bad, Lord. I guess. Oh. Uh, testing. Is is this mic on? Check one two. Check one two. My voice sounded weird in that. <clears throat> testing. Testing. Hold on, yep. got it. What's Can we get a little more volume friend? in this mic? No? An old friend then? Hey, what are you doing? Oh, that's right, it's that kind of world. Unfortunately, bud. That I'm in right now. I think it's just the brain, but it feels like boards. Oh. Oh. That 
damn it. It'd be easier if that was my right play. That of telekinesis. Oh, oh, I want to be on top. Now. The tip of the tongue, the lips and the teeth. Check one. Or is this two? Check one. Check one. Check. Spinnies. Man, those things are too fast. Check this out. Whoa! When you're alone as long as I was, time loses some of its meaning. And your perception of it becomes your reality. Wanna give it a try? to fuck with time. Nothing can hold me back now. I'm gonna... Reality. I don't want to use the thought tube while I'm inside a mine. I'm surrounded by so many strange thoughts. It might explode. Is this all the colors there are? You know, make a really loud sound. starting to remember sound. that there might be more. <clears throat> How you doing, Annie? Keeping that on our, I instinctively went for our. Ooh, I like that. Check, check, check. Are you copper bonding them, my man? No, I'm aluminium bonding them, my man. I'm surrounded by so many strange thoughts. It might explode. Or, you know, make a really loud sound. Check, check, check one. Check, check. Sibilance, sibilance. <clears throat> testing, testing. Check, check, check. Are you copper bottoming them, Mike? Check one. Check one. Can we get a little more volume in this, mic? Uh, testing. Is, is this mic on? I wonder. I don't want to use the thought tuner while I'm inside a mine. I'm surrounded by so many straight thoughts. It might explode. Hey, violin. That's a lot of fucking figments. I've got eyes on the target. And I've got eyes on me. Hi. Saw it. I just think we should be checking in with each other. You know? Oh. Fair enough. I uh, thought you could hide from me. Well, you almost did. Light and time bend together to fill the universe. 
Yeah. Uh, oh, I hope this looks better here. than last time. I was about to jump in there. <laughs> I think, honestly, so far this is my favorite world. No, I haven't done a lot of them, but still. Back there in a second. Probably have to drop down from the top. Oh, what's this? Do you eat it? Only if you're not careful. Whee! Oh, let's do that again. I'm gonna go back around and see if that door opened yet. Good thought provoking stuff. It's all so beautiful. Mm -hmm. But it's too much. Too many colors. Don't panic. Ah, you said panic. Hell yeah. Oh, thank you. I don't know what got into me. Oh. Huh. This 
guy needs a double bag tag. Well, we're not gonna have one for a while, probably. Once we get these light ticklers hooked up, the stage show is gonna be incredible. Oh, probably those. Might be able to get up there with that. Don't know. Ah, here's the hat box tag. Hat box, but not duffel bag. Close to the duffel bag, but not the hat box. Right now. I said this, but eyeballs are kind of gross. If you look at them closely, I already feel horrible for saying that. Uh, love this side thing. Oh, I feel like that's. Hmm. Oh, I think it was I named this one. Bob. This is a blender. Oh, you're right. It's a lamp. A lamp for making drinks. I see you. I s glad to be seen. Actually, I was about to say I see you, but I don't. Yep. 
I don't want to go over there. What's here? Nothing. Cool. I almost messed that check, up. Check, check one, check one, two, check one, two, three. But what was over there? Oh, just another way up. You know what? What? Ow. Maybe these friends are different. No. All the giant eyes. You would think. Thought I saw another one, but I did not. Gabe says hi. Hello, Gabe. Please don't. Like, I enjoyed this section. I just wanna get out of here, you know, man. Alright, it's a violin! That's what we wanted! Well, what are you waiting for? Is there something on his other shoulder? No. He heard you. Fair enough. That must have hurt. Well, and it's better, but to handle a crowd Your phone that size, is doing we need call. the whole band, man. Fair enough. We need Tasty, Sniffles, Dr. Touch. And Audie. Yeah, Audio. You're remembering, man. <laughs> Where are they all now? Oh, they wandered off when the audience left. Could be anywhere. This festival covers so many acres. Hey! Didn't we used to have a cool band van? Feel <laughs> mobile! Do he hear you? I am glad I am hurt. I'll oh. bet they're still at the festival somewhere. Woohoo! So what's driving? Careful. This van's barely holding together as it is. These are the concession stands. If they got hungry, they'll be here. 
Driving around, they collecting all the into the campgrounds, it's true. We're not here to run people over, all right? Whoops. Ooh, our promoter's not gonna like that. I'll go concessions first. Good idea. Let's look here. Tasty and Sniffles hung around here a lot. Oh, so many scents and flavors. And lines, man. So many long lines. I'll go find Tasty and Sniffles. <sighs> yes, got the devil back tag. I don't want to go back in the green man's mind, man. But I will if I must. Oh, that's just water. Fair enough. A little bird. I think I hear some emotional baggage near me. Nick, aren't they? I feel bad about cutting in line, but I'm on a mission. Well, that was almost bad. Circus dates, except we never really had crowds. Oh, I think I hear some. Hi, <laughs> Craig. I was gonna say, I thought I saw a pigment there. Any little nicks. I have a bad feeling about this place, I'll be honest. Segments. Most of these concessions seem to be all out, so they're probably waiting in line for a different one. Well, obviously, because they're not here. That's my guess for now. That's the music festival over there. The actual music. 
is just food. Excuse me? Hang on, kid. We're trying to decide what to order. You can eat after the show. Vision and Psy King are waiting by the van. What? Psy King is back? Let's get our instruments. We've been in this line for so long, I'm not even sure where they are. Hmm. I see, I see. So, um, questions? How do you see? Mouth? Nose. Actually, I've been needing this a bit more. Do they have corn dogs? Do they have corn dogs? If so, that's what you should get. Kid, the psyching is back. This is no time for eating. I can't believe I just said that. I know that voice. Why don't you just buy new instruments? My instrument is like a part of me. Yes, mine too. But part of me I set down somewhere and I can't remember. If you guys let me take a look, I'll bet I can find them. Oh, Tasty, I can't decide. Well... Oh no. I prefer the I one. Voices, man. Maybe I can find yeah. their instruments before they make up their minds. I have to admit, I'm a little afraid of this one. Why? Because of all the tongues what and are these made of? <laughs> That's all just part of being in a band, man. I don't. I don't. I don't know about that I'm one. I'm just but... assuming these are big gumballs. Oh. <laughs> Thought that was a new thing where I had to throw the gumballs into it. I don't like that one. Not one bit. They do have certain ones they have to go to. Smells like the way across. The secrets of the universe always on the tip of your tongue. Hmm. I gotta go this way. How do I catch the turtle? Pop in here, damn trip. Yeah. Um. Turtles, you gotta use a leaf to capture. Oh. Yeah, I don't like the sound either. Gotta use what? A uh, lead. The rope. You need a slime to get one. Or just be lucky finding one in like a. Um... Oh, and in my shop. To be honest, this is more tongue than I would prefer. It's one of those double decker buses. I fucked up. But I still made it. <laughs> Oh, 
Here's the steamer trunk tag. We did it! Uh, it's not a candy. So many people eat without really tasting. Such a shame. I swear I can taste this thing. That certainly took a long time. Come on, our fans are waiting. Also, I'm pretty sure this uh, character is voiced by Jack Black. Maybe. Oh, there's the mouth boy over there. And there's the nose lady. Tastes like shoes, but new, What's apparently. That smell? Oh, God, it's my own sweat. Hey, hey, don't. I can smell my own sweat. You're not supposed to be able to do that, are you? Oh, God. Now I can taste it. God. God damn it, man. Now I gotta fight too, right? I hate it when I'm right. Is racing. Do I have a heart? Stay calm, man. Stay calm. My fight or flight response is triggering. I say flight. Flight! Stay calm, man. Stay calm. <laughs> Done. That's always. You can't breathe without smelling. That's part of life. Hey. That is definitely Jack Black. Oh, thank you, brother. How you doing? Also, of course, it's Richard Horvitz. I knew that one. That nostril is as scary as a Saint Bernard turned inside out. Mm. I need. Ooh. You know that without smelling, most flavors fall flat. That's a ghost fact. Them and his voice seems to go through all right. Also, I'm Billy fine. from Billy and Mandy. I, do I, go flying like a racket ball. Do I, I think that? I need to upgrade my no, I don't. Game before I can connect ideas like that. 
feel like I'm finally getting the hang of these mental connections. When you grapple an enemy, now dish out damage. Four. Oh. Not there yet. Die from angry beavers. Yeah. Whoa, I did not see that coming. Oh, hey, I now have four, so I can do that. Apples can finish more quickly. Nice. This area really smells. Ah. Exhausted, we're gonna off five. Yes. There's the guitar. Oh, straight down. Hmm. Right, I don't need to be over there. My instincts are Pick telling me not to hold this thing too long. Fancy some candy. I like the smell of this bridge. A snack is going to something you give, and something you People just don't appreciate flavor. But I loved it. Ooh, that's a good look on you, Psy King. We need to get the whole band back together. Am I right? We need Dr. Touch. And we need audio. I don't know about the new look there, buddy. Excited about getting the band back together, Vision? I will be as soon as Audio and Dr. Tatcha are with us. So, why aren't you the singer? You wouldn't ask that if you ever heard the Psyching sing. He is amazing. He's the best. Oh, please, you're making me blush. Hold on. So, why aren't you the singer? You wouldn't ask that if you ever heard the Psyching sing. He is amazing. He's I feel like best. that's the narrator oh, please, for um, you're making me blush. Little Big Planet. Sentai. Very funny. Hey, how are you, Ball of... I mean, psyching? I'm a little overwhelmed, but, you know, too much sense is better than none, right? Let's go somewhere else. Everybody, back in the van. Can't beat that old van smell. Where are we going? I found the horn button. They might have wandered into the campgrounds, it's true. Sorry. Ooh, our promoter's not gonna like that. Good idea. Let's look here. I don't like the E. Well, this is the campground. Dr. Touch and Artie used to like to come here. They like to get high out here. So, you're saying they're up there? <laughs> the view up there is amazing. Yeah. I, I bet. Oh, 
gotta wonder, does his view of me change? Maybe I should just take a nap. Not yet, it hasn't. I've heard about music festivals like this, but this one is surprisingly clean. Hey, a bag! <laughs> nice. Still, where are all the bathrooms? Try to come. Oxygen gas. Oh, that's fun. Big circle though. Which is also fun. I guess, yeah. I don't want the plot first. Let's explore first. We always do. No, we don't. See? There you go. Me? You started this. Oh, choo choo. Here comes the blame train. For someone who's all ears, you really don't know how to listen. For someone who's all fingers, you've really lost your grip on reality. Are you full of wax or something? Look, I don't want to fight. Me either. Let's just be quiet. Fine with me. Me too. <laughs> Didn't you guys see the huge crowd down there? People are screaming for the Feast of the Senses. That's what I've been telling this one. But the problem with him is that he just won't listen. Without Psyking, there is no feast. There's nothing. But Psyking is back. What? He's down by the van with Vision. But we're not ready. We haven't practiced. Dr. Touch, where are our instruments? I, I thought you had them. Oh, wrong, wrong button. A few seconds here, game. We always do. No, we don't. See? Here you go. Me? Yeah, we can. You started this. Oh, choo choo. Here comes the boy. Here, boy. Flame train. We need those instruments. The crowd's getting angry. Hey, that kind of pressure is not helping. Yes, that makes us just want to stay up here. We're in safe. perform without your instruments? What could we possibly perform without our instruments? Hmm. Magic? I do know a little <laughs> sleight of hand, you know. Please. Let me take a look. I bet I can find them. Sounds good to me. Let me give you a hand. Nope. Didn't like that one. 
liked it more than the nose, I guess, but... Okay, yeah. two instruments coming up. Hey, I love what they've done with the place. Okay, let's get those instruments and get out of here. If I know Audie, this is gonna sound awesome. Oh, and Dr. Touch is good, too. Dr. Touch can be a little handsy. <laughs> I just noticed the tree. I feel like there's a lot of ways to get to the same place. Oh, Audie and I used to sneak up here and talk about our hopes and dreams. So beautiful. Aha! The instruments! Nothing between. Like Audie O is Will Arnett. Maybe I could be very wrong. Oh, very clever slowing that down. I was about to suggest it. Seagrass, but they're very slow. They can't be. Used. Oh! I am sorry. I honestly, uh, honestly thought you could. Oh no. I'm sorry. Didn't I? All right. No, I didn't. I'm right behind. Actually, uh, that'll be more helpful. Get it out again. This thing used to be such a dangerous area, I swear. Oh no. Me, but maybe you should just burn them all. That was the plan. Give the old one too. Oh. It used to be such a dangerous area, I swear. You want me to take care of these guys? Time to fight three of them. Wasn't expecting that, so... Put that there. Oh, I can hear. 
Oh, you over there? Some of it. Oh no. I can't breathe. Stay calm, man. Stay calm. Ooh. Oh. Ha. All right. I'm feeling better. I'm ready to help. <laughs> I genuinely expected there to be three. Now that that's done. You don't need to reach far to touch the I am loving this one so much. Oh, I gotta say, Sacking, you're almost looking like your old self again. I'm sorry I abandoned the band, you guys. Hey, it's gonna make for a better rockumentary someday. <laughs> Time for the feast. Feast! Just a thought is all I've got Now my cover's low At the bottom of a lake Of frozen feeling When my Wait. friends pulled me back up That will be it. I started Healing And I wasn't expecting this song. But fuck, do I love it? It was him. Uh oh. Oh no, not again! I know her from Lobato's nightmare. I know her from my nightmares. <laughs> Don't worry, all your friends are here. Friends? Oh, do you mean these friends? The ones who abandoned him in the ice for 20 years. Don't listen to her. Dear universe, please, shut up! There we go. That's hmm. better. Problem solved. Ball of light? Your helmet full bear! Everyone thinks you died in the deluge of Grulovia. What happened? <sighs> I can't remember much of anything. Well, if you don't mind, I can try to help with that. I love this. This is great. What 
What's going on here? Ah, this was my stupid plan to defeat Malik. Oh, I I didn't mean to do that. You were going to act her to death? I did a monologue about Lucy's life and what she meant to us. To try and bring her back. I was useless that day. You think you were useless that day? I tried to stop her with a motivational speech. Actually, Fulbert, you distracted her long enough that I was able to recruit some local animals to help. Which also didn't work. We all brought what we had to the battle. The main thing was, your beautiful performance did bring out the old Lucy. Just for a bit. It reminded us that she was in there. So... Maligula used to be your friend? And her name was Lucy? <sighs> was she the seventh member of the Psychic Six? Lucretia Mux, but she went bad somehow and then you all had to go fight your friend? I liked not remembering stuff. <laughs> I'm learning a lot. Yeah, me too. I'm learning a lot. Yeah, me too. I'm right here! Where are you going? Why did you all abandon me for a thousand years? Twenty. Maybe in your world? Did they even look for me? Did they all forget I existed? We did look for you, full bear. But my stupid hyper high glaciator there, which we brought to freeze Maligula, well, it's uh... It worked as designed, Otto. But you were so deep in that frozen lake, we couldn't find you. No matter how much we dug. I know you're just speculating here, Helmet. I think you're probably right. But I sent you my brain, Ford. Didn't you find it? I... I don't know. Ford must have brought your brain back because I found it in Otto's lab. But he must have lost that memory when his mind was shattered in the battle. My brain was shattered? Well, come on. It was a little cracked to begin with. <laughs> oh. If my body's been in hyper ice all this time, I'll bet I look amazing. Maybe. Almost done. Almost done. I'm starting to enjoy it now. Almost done. I'm starting. Oh no, I can't look. This is where that monster drowned my Bobby. Because I failed. Because my stupid plan couldn't save him. No. You saved me. You threw yourself into the path of danger, sacrificing yourself to save me. Rather dramatically, I might add. Well, I mean, thank you. So, I'm not dead. I'm out there somewhere waiting for you to come back to me. I'm coming to you, right now. I swear. Better hurry. You know how I get. Memories, my boy. Just a show we put on inside our heads. Sometimes the first draft of the script stinks. Thanks for helping me with the rewrites. <laughs> now let's go give the people what they want. <laughs> Everybody stand back. Remember, this is our friend, Lucy. She's going through a tough time. I think she might just need someone to listen to her. Save your sympathy for your shrubbery, Zanato. Time out, 
Lulu. your body yet for bear but not to worry I've got your brain and I'm gonna keep it safe back at HQ and come back for the rest of you it's after I figure out what to do with Lucy okay I know you won't forget about me I don't think anybody's gonna forget about you after that performance in fact I think they're demanding an encore So, I said it earlier, and I'm gonna say it again, this is my favorite fucking world, my favorite brain. This is so damn cute. Yeah, yeah. I'm, I'm sitting over here just like, oh yeah. Happy. It's too damn cute is what it is. Senior staff only. I'm... Who am I again? Nick John Smith. Nick John Smith, senior mailroom staff. Welcome. Helmet Fulbear, <laughs> deceased. About time they sent me an assistant. Ford's gonna be so excited when he figures out who you really are, Agent Fulbear. Everybody is. Kid, I owed you one. And now we're square. But I'm not ready to face Cruller. Not until I talk to Bob. But Lots of baggage to unpack. You wouldn't understand. But please, tell no one of my return. But... I'll see you at curtain call! Oh, somebody shut that door before the wind blows all my letters away! I forgot this is what I was doing. there, Ford. Excuse me, Agent Crawler? Clerk Crawler. Yes? Hmm. How are you feeling? Busy. It's like nobody's been sorting the mail for days. You seem crockety. Would you mind if I, uh, went inside your mind and sorted a few things out? Eh, I'm never opposed to anything getting properly sorted. So it doesn't just fucking Here now. I am going to, however, put that back there, put that there. Dear Ford, we brought peace to Grulovia, but there is still unrest among the people. A little ungrateful, I think. Home soon, Lucretia. Hmm. Yeah. Whoa! 
There's a piece of Ford's mind in here for me to reconnect. It'll probably be up in that giant clunky head. Hey, I came out of that clunky head. Really? Can you help me get in there? Uh, maybe, to tell you the truth. I'm not addressed very well, so... I'm sure I'll be marked return to sender and sent back there soon. Just grab on. Did someone say return to sender? <laughs> This letter's got no return address. I'm afraid that means the dead letter office for you. But wait, I'm a heartfelt love letter. Don't care who you courted, the feelings must get sorted. Uh, that's all the way over there. They just keep coming. What's the point? Nobody ever writes what they really mean. They have them themselves on these levels in games? Yeah. I wrote a letter once. Did I think I could stop a war? Nah, doesn't matter. I never sent it. Maybe it would have saved a thousand lives. Maybe just one. I nope. wonder what would have happened if I'd sent that letter. I wonder if it's too late. They went hard, they fucking Get did. Get me out of this graveyard! Lucy, haven't heard from you in a while. Send us a card, or better yet, come home. We miss you. Four. Western Valeria! Oh, I know it's an actual place yep. in this game, but still. Hey! Over here! I am collectathoning. Thank you very much. God, I love the sound of the paper. I don't belong in here. Yep. If I get you out of here, will you still take me up to the head? Yes, but quick, before he... Whoa! <laughs> Look at that address. It belongs in the international dead letter office. What? No, wait. Uh oh. <laughs> oh. I haven't seen one of you in a while. I should not burn you. No, I think it's a felony. Ah, as if you could harm the power of the mail. It's indestructible. <laughs> Uh, uh. I don't want to fight it. Damn, bro, that sucks. Come on, come on. Burn the mail. The world may never know. Two Lucretia Mucks stop. 
Anti-war protests threaten peace. Stop. Great unwashed need a cold shower. Stop. For Glulovi. Czar Theodore. Going upward, I see. Downward was not a funny place. Come on, Mai. Gentle rain's not enough to secure my reign. Stop being coy with the hoi polloi. I'm trying. I 
know I can do this. There we go. My hands on the wrong buttons there. letters. War is over now, the people are a problem. Letter friend to us. And country discontinued. Country discontinued. Fair enough. Feel better. Where? That's my last letter. Jump. I'm sorry, a hundred percent, and I've only got a half a brain. I love it. you out of here. Oh no. Oh no. Some letters are such a pain in the neck. They really belong in the furnace. 
Wait. I think I know how to address this one. Really? Well, it's worth a shot. But don't take all day. The mail must sail into tomorrow. No time to borrow. Boy, I hope you know what you're doing. Uh, I hope the game does, because I personally don't. Let's turn to return to center. I think that's the key I need over there. Uh, oh. Hey, okay. I think that's a key to the typewriter. That's I think I know who Ford would like to address this letter to. Oh yeah. Send it to Lucretia. Boing. I actually need to, uh, yep. sit still. Lucy, <sighs> I wish I weren't so bad at this. See what we get. I wasn't expecting that. You see, the mail just doesn't matter. Anyway, Nala wants to be let out, so give me two seconds. Right, yes, I'm taking you out. I return. The boy is out now. And I'm about to enter Ford's brain. Part one. Oop. 
Hmm. This is a private mailbox. You aren't allowed in here. You've been missorted. You touch that, and it's a federal crime. What did you say in that letter? Nothing important, really. Just that I loved her. She just wanted to help, but they, they pushed her too far. Well, how should we have known? It's not like she was marked fragile. But I thought I knew her and everything she held inside herself. Ah, I had so much to learn. I guess some packages are better left unopened. One piece of Ford's mind connected, now for the other two. I hope I'm doing the right thing, but Agent Zanotto is right. We'll need Ford at full capacity if we're gonna have a chance against Molecular. And time stop. Wrong one. Next up, one of the other two Fords. Damn, what's wrong? Oh. Time. These new time bubble pins. Time bubble, huh? These up objects and enemies rather than slowing them. No! It's a time bubble to slow much bigger area. Hmm. A boy's pain. I uh, do some more time out of your time bubbles. Nine cards. Time. You know, I already loved Ford as a character. I'm I'm loving him even more now. I could have bought that. I had no reason, but I mean, uh, tell me how you like it. Oh, good choice. Dream Fluff saved my psychic butt. Thanks for visiting the automatic. Got five. What did I need five for? Mental connections level 30. Yeah. Oh, never mind then. No, I want this. Ground pound looks pretty off chocolate. Nice. This is weird. Is it break time yet? Mm. Psst. Hey, hey, got some fresh stuff over here. Brand new. Sidecar! 
I need to see what you see me as. Thank you. Time to go find some bees. I'm sorry? Why bees? Why specifically bees? There. Fair enough. Right, the man wants bees. Uh, he wants to come forget forest, get there, I'll have to drive through all my quests from the area. Right, yep. Excuse me, Ford? Sorry, with a client right now. Obviously. You done with Think you'll be soon? done with that haircut soon? Please, you can't rush an artist. I see a big missing chunk on this side. What's that? Not to fear, only temporary. All part of the process. <laughs> I'll let you get back to it. I'll let you get it. back to your haircut. Huh? What? Are you still here? God, I love Ford. Come back to the automatic. Many new items in stock. Scanning for And I think it was to the left near the um the bee man's area. From prying eyes. Um, this is the lobby? Uh nobody comes down here. There's some weird kid right over there. So what? He's not gonna tell your husband anything. Sorry, am I interrupting a secret meeting? Were you eavesdropping? Oh, I knew this was a bad idea. Get lost, kid. Hello. Not now, kid. Busy. <laughs> How do you see me? <laughs> yep. I hope my family didn't cause too much trouble. You're lucky my family never comes to visit me. Ever. Isolation. I was lucky up until that last part. Oh yeah, the family's this way. I was gonna say, that didn't fucking work. Uh, what was I saying? Alright, if that didn't work, I would have just gone this way anyway. I, I uh, I put a different button. I want that card. Yoink. I didn't want to go this way, burn it all. I turn on it. Burn. Not as nice as kill mine, but burn. I 
I want what's up there. Don't even know what it is. Don't want it. That's dynamite. I don't think that's how that works, Raz. Crazy? You up here? I'm telling mom you threw a rock at me. It was a pine cone, you baby. Ow! That was a rock. I'm warning you. <laughs> Weird fucking mine entrance. Beaver. I, okay. I, I like beaver. Beaver is nice. Not as nice as Flamingo, but... Oh. Right, so yep. this is the questionable area. <laughs> Fuck. I wanna be here. And that's the flamingos. I'm going back to where I burned. Last cap, Becky Kate. I'll card down there, but I don't want that right now, because that would involve climbing back up here. It doesn't look like a death trap to me. Yet. Right, this is for Lil. This quest is for Lil. Last cap, Becky. You in here? Guess this mine is really dangerous for skeletons. Box up there. Oh. I'm sure there'd be smaller explosive. Anyway. Thing. Yep. Oh. Never said I was good at this game, or any game for that matter. Not help I needed. Oh. 
I'm just gonna hold W. No jump. I need to jump apparently. Oh, I'm supposed to climb up that. Eh. That was quicker. More dangerous, but quicker. Let's go to the beginning, I feel very uh, certain way. Fire. Fire is a good um, feeling here. My attack Looks like rainbow. the Quato family circus has traveled through here, all right. Yep, we had to hightail it out into the woods because you're ashamed of being an Aquato. I'll stop being ashamed of that. If you stop being ashamed of being a psychic. <laughs> oh, you're asking for it, Raspy. Frazy, it's okay. You can tell Dad now. You don't have to hide anymore. <sighs> this is your last warning. Frazy? <sighs> Ow! More where that came from. Map available? I would say that's a questionable map, yes. That's and tipping. The entrance to the forgetful forest is somewhere here in the questionable area. You leaving the questionable area? Check car for squirrels. Uh, that's a oh. Guess my family has chosen where to set up the Aquato Dome. Number stack diamond. Hell yeah. Oh, nice. Oh, for Lancelot, thank you. Are those the acorns I asked for? Yes? No. No, they can't be, can they? No, because I asked for acorns that were crushed, didn't I? Didn't I, Fur Lancelot? I hate to yell at you, Fur Lancelot, but I... I... I am the crushed one. It crushes my heart to see you not doing your best. Understand? Now, do I need to show you how to crush things? 
No? You sure? Okay. Good boy. Now, try again. But this time, think about personal commitment and delivering excellence every day. All right? Sorry you had to see that, Raz. <laughs> well then. Hey, Sam. Talk fast. Cakes are cooking. Work for Lancelot, indeed. What about pancakes? I have some questions about pancakes. <laughs> Start flapping, Jack. Why didn't you just go order some pancakes at the cafeteria? Agent Oleander didn't give me any money. I assumed to test my resourcefulness. <laughs> What's your recipe? Just the basics, you know, eggs, milk, flour. Found he most of it here did. with a couple quick substitutions. What sort? What sort of substitutions? If I told you, it would compromise the perceived flavor profile. Isn't that just straight up dirt? For the umami. <laughs> nice one, go. Ah, uh, she is still my favorite. Aren't all the supplies here kind of old? Look, you can't take the expiration dates too seriously. They're just the food industry protecting itself from lawsuits. And protecting us from, like, food poisoning? Psst. No one's getting sick from my pancakes. Unless one of you jerks didn't wash their hands. Eh, better late than never. Where'd you get the milk? <laughs> from the goats? Oh... Yeah, that would have been easier. Hey, it brought us closer, Fran. You used eggs you found here? Old eggs? I'm loving no. this entire conversation. Oops. I found some fresh ones. And you know, if you use enough syrup, you can't tell chicken from snake. Eggs is eggs. Can I have a pancake? You can have any that fall on the floor. Thanks. <laughs> Where'd you learn how to make pancakes? Prison. Wait, what did I say? I meant from my mother. I'm out of pancake questions. Good, because I'm out of pancake puns. Oh, I love her so much. What are you much. doing out here? Well, you know my intern mentor, Coach Morso Oleander? Uh, yeah. Well, this is the first assignment he gave me. Mission. Get me some pancakes so I can think. I think it's supposed to teach me something about the many layers of the mind. Maybe. I know the butter stands for lateral thinking. I got that much. Can I ask you about your family? Why? Because my last name is Ghoul? And because that's a famous family in the Psy community? And you want to network with me to further your Psy career? Go for it. <laughs> I'm a friend of your brother's. Hmm, your head looks remarkably unexploded. Oh, it must yeah. be the health. Dogen, yeah. Has your brother Dogen really made someone's head explode? No, never. Wait, you mean someone who didn't deserve it? No. I mean, like, anybody. Look, whole body's nerfect. <laughs> Am I right? Instant regret. Can everyone in the pool family talk to animals? Most of us can talk to them, but few of us really know how to listen to the animals. You know, for instance, I can hear you rolling your eyes, Mrs. Thatcher. What can you tell me about Compton Pool? Mm, Gramps is nice and all, but honestly, he's a little weird. <laughs> no. Still too tough. Okay, I'll stop asking about your family. The bull's got nothing to hide. Unlike some of these squirrels. Relax, I'm talking about your nuts. You guys still hide nuts, right? <laughs> you guys, learn to laugh a little, okay? You'll live longer. So... Have you always wanted to be a psychonaut, too? Uh, 
Not really. My true dream is to be a pet therapist. Because I'm really good with animals. Right, guys? Are you worried about Maligula? Raz, Maligula's ancient history. My grandpa killed her by triggering an elephant stampede. What? I never heard Look, about... you believe the official story, do you? I gotta go. Catch you on the flip side. <laughs> yes, it is funny every time. It really is. <laughs> I I enjoyed that Hi. conversation entirely. Hmm. There's a narrow slot that I don't think I can fit you. Uh, gotta go deal with Raz's family. He really is. You found Bucky Fierro's questionable area. Present in your house, Squid. I will this see is you soon. and you're listening to KLOB. Creepy, there you are. Aw, oh, man, you found my private dancing place. Sorry. Too late. You ruined it. <laughs> uh, Mom's looking for you. Where's the mother? I would suppose this way. <laughs> I forgive you. Mom? I mean, if little children never ran away from home, where would the circus get her workers, huh? <laughs> uh. What matters is that the Aquatos are all together again. And this little adventure of yours has actually given me fresh inspiration for our act. Me too! Did you see that unnatural and slightly gimmicky waterfall over there? The one flowing upside down? Stay away from it. No water. Too late, Nona. It has already watered the flower of inspiration in my heart and blossomed in two. Guess what I called it. Guess. The upside down waterfall? The Devil's Fire Hose! <laughs> Let's show our runaway how we do it, everybody. Creepy, on the bottom. This would be easier if you didn't use so much hair grease. It'd be easier if your head weren't so pointy. I like it. Now, I like Rasputin, it. Up top you go. I don't like it. Yes, son. And then you could add a little psychic flourish by levitating this pine cone. No, no. Then we pass each person up the tower like water flowing. No psychic flourishes. I told you. We are acrobats. We don't do parlor tricks. Uh, guys. Why not a little of both? Pops. Oh, pretty. You guys! Oh, shush! This is why we taught you how to fall as babies. <sighs> it's no use. We need the Aquatodome. <laughs> I'm on it. Help him out, would you, Pooty? He's had to take on so much extra work since you abandoned your family and broke our hearts. That's a good boy. Ah, yes. Little trip. <laughs> if there's one thing the Aquatos know how to do, it's making themselves at home. Anywhere. Nice trick, Tala. Is Nona looking? Yes. And she looks really impressed. <laughs> oh. Hi, Nona. Oh, hello, my sweet little turnip. Are you comfortable? Do you need anything? I'm happy as long as I'm with my family. 
Aren't you cold out here in the woods? Ugh, please. I'm from Golovia. This is nothing. Can I ask you about the curse? Don't go near the water. Yes, I know about that part, but... Then you know the whole thing. All you need to know. Mm. Do you hate psychics as much as Mom? You mean fortune tellers? Like the Galonkios, the ones who cursed us? They are not natural. They are not trustworthy. <laughs> Nona, who's your favorite grandchild? It's me, right? Oh, of course, you are my favorite. My sweet little Dion. Well, I gotta go back to my spy stuff. Good boy, now don't get that big head. Oh, I like it. Hey, Mom. Hmm. Oh, yes, Rasputin? Yeah. Okay, I'm going to go practice my acrobatics. Uh-huh. Remember, every time you lie, it takes a day off your mother's life. Hmm. You really want to help me? Go find your brother, Queepy. He's wandered off again. Hmm. What was I doing out here again? Oh, right. Compton needs a bee from the forgetful forest. I'm not forgetful, guys. Maybe. Well, actually, I very much am. In certain things. Other things, I'm fine. I should go find Queepy. That. I doubt I could do that again, even if I tried. Burn. Hatchet, huh? Target practice. Ah, there we go. What? There are no rules in horseshoes, just the shoe, the stake, and your mind. Close enough. Yep. Oh. Sure. Better be a real Yeti in here, or I want my money back. Creepy. I like it. Fast pops is. Whoa! 
The expiration date on this thing is the year I was born. Versus Nessie, who would win? Balls, opposable thumbs, possible psychic powers. Will I give some yes. Larger, swims, bigger teeth, more established Please. fan base. Nessie would totally win because Nessie is real. That's not fair, yes. Ross. That's for inciting violence between cryptids. Ooh. Hey, what's back here? I love it. Yep. Come with me, the side challenge marker. I'm starting to see why this questionable area went out of business. What are you listening to? Some local radio station. I have no idea where it's coming from, but I love it. Oh, can I listen to it with you? No. Oh, then. Like a carrot. Well, it's not a psychic arrow heading this one, but that's all I was thinking of right then. I may have forgotten I didn't have my uh straight through the eyes. That's cute. Okay. Let's see if there are any straight bots around. I think it's over this one. That's that's a lot of stray thoughts. That's one rank up for me. One new home for you, side challenge marker. Son, think I'm getting any better at this? Just keep practicing. That's it? Press harder on your temples. Really? I'm already getting a bit of a bruise there. <laughs> Clear your mind. If it were any emptier, I'd pass out. Focus on the hottest thing you can think of. Okay, then. I'm thinking of your mother. Dad! Uh, We're uh, human beings, Rasputin. I love it. You're really taking to this psychic stuff. Like, really hard. Well, I guess I'm making up for lost time. Plus, it could be a fun father and son activity for us to do together, don't you think? Uh huh. But Dad, can I ask you about where we come from? You mean, Golovia? That's a sad story, son, 
but there were some glory days back in the old country. The Aquatos were part of a very prestigious national circus there. We even performed for the Tsar and his family from time to time. But then that monster Maligula ruined everything. Actually, Maligula's not ancient history. Some of her followers are trying to bring her back to life. What? The Psychonauts think one of her delusionists have infiltrated the base as a mole. Then be careful what you tell them, son. You're more connected to Maligula than you should say. What's what? that? What do you mean we're connected to Maligula? She comes from the Galocchio family. The family that cursed all of our family to die in water? Son, she is the Galocchio who cursed our family to die in water. And it worked. My father drowned in the Valermo Dam disaster. But my mother, your Nona, survived. She escaped Golovia and came here to get away from the curse. Yeah. What do you think of the Devil's Fire Hose? Oh, it's going to be a showstopper, I can tell. Your mother never disappoints, you know. I just wish she'd let me add a little, you know, razzle-dazzle. Oh, yes, like that. <laughs> Thanks for helping out back at summer camp. Well, I could tell somehow you were in trouble. Probably because of our psychic connection. So, how is Lily? I couldn't help but notice when I was inside your mind <laughs> that you had some uncertainty about the status of your relationship. What's that? Just tell her how you feel, son. Tell us all how you feel, Raz. I don't <sighs> like you, Norma. I don't think Mom's on board with this psychic stuff. Oh, she'll get used to it. Like she did with my model train, Hobby. <sighs> Still so sad about how that elephant sat on my whole collection. Dad, our circus doesn't have any elephants. Hmm. True. Not sure where that animal came from. I'll have to ask your mother. Augustus. She's the one who saw it happen. You know who else in the family is psychic, right? Does it rhyme with Daisy? Yes, and also with Lazy. Well, if that's true, then it's for her to tell us about some, not you. <sighs> yeah, I guess you're right. I had that coming. <laughs> I'll let you get back to practicing. Yes, yes. I think I'm almost there. And... Oop, wrong button. <laughs> Did you see that? How could I not? It caught fire! A little... Mr. Aquato, you almost started a forest fire just then! Don't like her. Not at all. That's going to be the end of it for tonight. So thank you all for joining me, as always. I hope you had a great one, and I'll see you all in the next one. Have a good one, and goodbye.